Welcome to Sikior, guys. Look how clear the water is. Wow. Good morning, everyone. Beautiful morning. We're down at the port. We're going to be taking the ocean jet today. Traveling over to Sikior. Look down here, this is where Beppo Guest House is. Why not? And you have Silliman right here to the right. And this is the entryway to the port, guys. Well, guys. That's where I'm going, going to the Philippines. Welcome to the port of Dumaguete, guys. So that's where you would drive in. All kinds of vendors over here. They'll be opening up soon. Beautiful morning, guys. So this is as you just come inside, guys, into the gate area. Once you come in, guys, even when you go online, you'll have to come here to have a ticket printed. You can book online, look with it, but you still got to come to this counter to get your receipt printed out. So, and then you go over into the waiting area. With every smile, with every beat, in your arms I find my peace. With you, my world is so sweet. This is your waiting area, guys. It's not really big. guys you'll have to pay a terminal fee for each passenger 15 pesos there's a more commercial size uh, one we're not picking out we're picking the two jet guys you can take uh, fast cat fast craft ocean jet is 45 minutes from Dumaguete port to Sikular in your love, I find my way. You make so there you go, guys. There's a row, row. You can see the back of the truck up onto it. That's a smaller one, guys. Much smaller than the other ones that I've uh, been on. Gorgeous morning out there, guys. The water looks good and cold. It could be nice for 
Cut the cross. Just take your so there's an ocean jet 888 that just came in that's what we'll be taking so that ocean jet there will take 45 minutes to get from dumagetti port to secure port there are other ferries that will cost you less but they'll take a lot longer so the 45 minute ride is is okay with me. You're always near and your eyes my path is clear. Every moment with you is a gift. With you I feel uplifted. You can see everybody's arrived and they're getting off the ocean jet guys and we'll be getting on. With you my world is so sweet. This could be you too. Don't wait, make your dreams happen, guys. First time we booked, well, I booked online. I'm going to be charged for booking online instead of going in person, but it's okay. It was very easy. Well guys, there you go. You have a fast cat here in Montiagro. They're leaving. There's another Montiagro. And we have the ocean jet that we will be taking and that is downtown Dumaguete. And you are at the port of Dumaguete, guys. Guys, we are on the ocean jet now. Give you a little bit of a tour. Everybody's heading over to Sikior, guys. Beautiful day, guys. Downtown Dumaguete. Nice and air conditioned in here, guys. So you pay a little more money for the air conditioning, but it's worth it. There's an upper floor with no air.
Welcome to Sikior, guys. Look how clear the water is. Wow. Beautiful, hey eh, guys? You can see the starfish all in there. Look at all the starfish. This is the port of Sikior. Just took the ocean jet, guys. Ocean jet 888, and that took less than 45 minutes. This is the port of Secure. Just took the ocean jet. Took less than 45 minutes to get here from Dumaguete. For us to say here in Visayas, maayong pagabot. Welcome to the healing paradise of Sikihor. My name is Ed, and together with me is Kuya Sidro. Hello. Hello. Who will be driving us today to the resort. So we have actually three ports here in the island, Larana Port, Lazi Port, and Sikihor Port. You just arrive safely in the port of Sikihor. From here, going to Copper Grove would take us 15 to 20 minutes. Thank you. See, guys, there's lots of uh, trikes here. This is the exit, the uh, entry coming into the port. As you can see in front, in front is the St. Francis of Assisi Church. That is the oldest church here in the island and it was established in 1783. On your right side, you can also see the bell tower that served as the watchtower before for any possible pirates and it's made of coral stone. Just to give you an overview about the island, the island was first named as Katugasan because the island was surrounded by mulavi trees or tugas while Spaniards call this island as Isla del Fuego or Island of Fire because when they discovered the island, they found that the island seems like there's a burning flame but it's actually the fireflies clustering in the Mulawi trees. Way of living here, tourism, farming and fishing. Population, approximately 103,000. We have six towns here in the island where in Sikior town is the capital town and then Lorena. Lorena is at the business center of the island. We have Lazi, Enrique Villanueva, Maria, and San Juan Town. San Juan Town is where we are heading right now. Um, first time for this group, uh, okay. Then for, for Sir and Ma, it's the second time. So for those who are first timer, welcome to Sikior. And just to give you an, uh, I will just give a brief orientation about the resort so you know what to do when we arrive here. The resort is a land area of 8 hectares. We have two restaurants at the moment, Casa Coco Restaurant and Coco Beach Bar and Restaurant. Breakfast served from any of those restaurants from 6 to 10 and then last cut off to order is 9.30. Casa Coco Restaurant served Filipino food, international food and seafood while Coco Beach Bar and Restaurant served mainly international cuisine and more in Mexican food. And then tonight, um, every Monday and Thursday night, Coco Beach Bar will have a barbecue dinner. It's dinner by the beach with live acoustic music, tribal band, and fire dancing. No cover charge. The entertainment is free. All you have to do is to order. So if you want to join, please make reservation at the front desk when we arrive. And if you wish to pamper yourself, we have temple spa for manicure, pedicure, food spa, fully body massage and foot massage. For 
for scuba diving, diving courses, and water sports activities, we have Dive Shop. Kayaking is free of charge to our Venus guests, and Dive Shop is open from 7 in the morning until 5 in the afternoon. And you can do snorkeling also because in front of the resort is the Tugut Marine Sanctuary. Now, if you don't have snorkeling equipment with you, we have a rent at the Dive Shop. Then, if ever the lady from the bottom diver has a sanctuary team, can you inform them that you are staying with us? Because for our enough guests, you don't need to pay for the sanctuary. We are in charge to pay for you. So just tell them your room number and they will ask payment for that. Okay? And then we have Island Treasure for souvenirs and other basic needs. We have gym. We do yoga class for free for our enough guests. We have games room where we do yards, dogs, and food for our people. We also have um, three swimming pools in the resort and then in the room we provide beach towels and room towels. For your beach towel, please bring it back to your room after using because loss of beach towel would cost 500 pesos. Same as your key, please look after your key because loss of key would cost 500 pesos also. And then to respect our bars and restaurants, food and drinks from outside are not allowed to bring inside. If you wish to go around the island, we offer tours via car, via tuk-tuk, and via jeepney. But if you want to do it by your own, we have scooter rental for you. It's 550 for the whole day. Just make sure that you have the actual driver's license. And if you wish to go to another island, we have an Apple Island trip where you can swim with a table size of turtles, beautiful fish, and birds. We also have Oslo trip where you can swim with a whale shark. So for Apple Island and Oslo, if you are interested, please sign in at the information desk because we will be needing many more participants and those are very difficult Okay, so I guess that's the end of the orientation. Do you have any questions, clarification, and so forth? Okay, so for now, sit back, relax, and enjoy the view. Salamat! San Juan Town is where Coco Grove Beach Resort located. And on your left side is the Kapilay Spring Park. That is a natural spring and that serve as a picnic area for the local folks, especially during weekends. It's open for everyone and it's free. Five minutes from now, we will arrive at Coco Grove Beach Resort. May I please request to please prepare your passport or any valid IDs because we will need it upon check. Thank you. Okay, we just arrived here at Coco Grove Beach Resort. Once again, I am Ed and we have Kuya Sidro here saying we hope a pleasant stay with us. Enjoy your stay and we'll see you around. Salama! Welcome to Coco Grove, guys. Get a nice refreshment. You've got the tuk tuks over here and you've got the scooters that you can rent. Beautiful 
all day, guys. Ooh, ooh. Nice watermelon, very fresh. This is your front welcoming area, guys. here for their uh, barbecue coming tonight. And Apple Island information. Here's one of the things you can do. You can do a sunset cruise, weather depending. Starting from Coco Grove at 4 p.m. Welcome to Secure, guys. Good morning. Beautiful morning, guys. So you've got signs. Show you where to go, guys. Beautiful, isn't it? Can you picture yourself here enjoying? So you got lots of signage, guys. So if you're going through the different areas, so you want to go to the spa. What a beautiful morning. Hello everyone, welcome to the Philippines. Wow, beautiful morning guys. I hope you're enjoying wherever you are in the world. Don't forget to subscribe guys. I have lots of videos to share with you with my journey going around the Philippines. Bye for now. Have a great day.